Well, we are, Taylor, because we've come down to Twin Dams and it's fairly quiet mammal-wise. But we have a very cool bird that we don't see that often. We have been seeing it quite regularly in this exact same spot. So it's our same male greater painted snipe. So for those of you that are keeping birdless, I know some of you must have it because this is, I think, the third or fourth time that I've seen it now on drives. But it hangs around at this particular little water source and look at its camouflage. So you can see now it's standing right out in the open. But most of the time it will be in amongst that marshy area and they really do blend in very well so it is a nice bird to see and funny enough in this bird most of our birds out here the males are actually bright more brightly colored than the females but here in this case the male is far more drab than what the female is he's got that white that goes over his head like a little white highlight on his from his beak to his back and then he's got those white eye stripes and a little collar around him. But the female is very pretty. She's got a rusty sort of chestnut brown head and, and throat patch. And she looks very cool. So this is the male that we're busy looking at on top. And you can see he's got that white that I was talking about. And that creamish white color going over the top of his head. White eye stripe and then the white shoulders. Whereas the female on top, she's got that rusty red color. Or like I say, chestnut neck and shoulders area and she, I think she looks prettier than he does but they've also got these sort of gold flecks when the sun hits them they are very pretty birds and they are an uncommon resident or a local nomad which means that they move around a little bit within the system and this guy we first started to see actually funny enough in about I think it was May maybe April is when I first spotted him in this area so he's been fairly resident since then and a really nice bird to see now, just now we had a situation where there was squirrels alarm calling. There were some impalas here, and all of a sudden 